Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back. Today's video is a um, affordable like handbag. I guess I don't want to call it a haul. We haven't completely come up with the name for this yet, but I always joke that my blog, which is she's that girl I will put the URL right here. Um, it is fashion lifestyle related just like my youtube channel but i always joke that i should have called myself the purse pusher because i'm always talking about handbags because i just love a good affordable handbag that lasts so the bags i'm going to show you today they're not designer except for one of them okay so four of the bags are affordable and then one of them is a more expensive so it's about 170 dollars pray it will be on sale when the time this video goes up because i think right now it's on sale for like 112 which isn't a lot to some people for a handbag especially a good handbag that's designer but i'm going to stop rambling and just get into it but before i do make sure to go below and subscribe if you are not already i put up three videos every single week and i want you to be a part of my youtube family if you are not already and yeah that's pretty much it so the first bag that I'm going to be talking about is the bag that I talk about all the time on my blog. It is the What's in My Handbag video that I have on my channel. It's got like 3.8 thousand views and for a new YouTuber that's like pretty big because I've been on YouTube for like three and a half months. So it's pretty awesome. But this is a black handbag from H&M and I got this last December. I got it December 6th. December 6th and it's September 23rd. And look at this. Do you see this? Do you see this handbag? Like I know in the light you can see some scratches, but like, do you know how many people think this is a Michael Kors handbag? A lot. And it was like $40. Now, because this bag is so popular, H&M has made a few styles that look just like it. This is the bag that I'm currently carrying, but I love this bag. It has held up so well. It's got really nice hardware. The hardware hasn't chipped at all. And what I love is that, <laughs> look how much crap I can fit down in there. I mean, it literally could fit everything except for the kitchen sink. And then you just have these two like zippers on the outside that are pretty deep. So I keep paperwork in that one that I need for like work and stuff that I just like always need on hand. And then this one actually is currently empty. It does have inner pockets, but I love this bag because it holds everything, $40. H&M, I'ma link it below. Don't you worry about that. The next bag is also H&M. I adore H&M, I love them because everything that they have is affordable and it, la well, they've kind of gotten into the higher quality stuff now, but like they can have a really nice coat there that's like $30 or they have a coat there that's like $180. It just depends on which part you shop in, but I have found that all of their stuff is really high quality, really nice, really well made. So even if you're paying $30, you're still gonna get a lot for that 30. But this is a handbag that I saw in stores and I was obsessed with it. I was like, I have to have it. They have it in like black, this color, which I consider this like to be a putty or like a taupe. Um, but I'm not sure they sell this exact color anymore. They sell it in leather and a pink color, black with studs. I believe they sell it in a maroon color as well. This bag is amazing. Now it doesn't have a regular like standard inner pocket. I think I just showed that this handbag and the black handbag in my fall fashion essentials video last week, but I didn't really show it to you guys. This does not have any like inner pockets as you can see. There's still some trash on it, sorry. But there is one really nice inner pocket that's very deep. So you do still have that zip storage. I would not recommend ever getting a bag that doesn't have zip storage that's this size because that's just not cool. Like <laughs> I need my storage, okay? And then it just zips over and this cute little clasp comes, comes all the way down. And then you have this like perfect little long strap. It does hit at about my waist or lower and then I'm five foot nine. So it's got a pretty long strap, but I love this bag. It's very durable. I've had it for about four months. I carried it for about four months straight, beat this bag to crap. You still can't tell. This bag is on sale a lot. So you can usually find it for like $30, $29 which is amazing. So this bag is a little bit smaller and it is also an H&M. This is the last H&M bag that I am featuring. Um, I bought this bag online because, I mean, it's gorgeous. I just love it. 
I was a little disappointed at how small it was. I knew it was a smaller bag, but I was disappointed at how small it was um, when it came in the mail. That's totally my fault. Uh, at H&M, you have to be careful. You have to like look at the sizes of things um, before you buy, but I love, like look at how nice the front of this bag is. It's got a really good texture to it. Doesn't scratch up easy, doesn't mess up easy. And then you open it up and it's got two little compartments. This bag does not have an inner zipper, so you're pretty much stuck with only putting stuff on the inner two pockets. There's nothing on the back. There looks like there's something, but there isn't. And so that's pretty much all you've got. Um, if you are one of those people who can carry stuff in smaller bags, you know, more power to you. This is more of like my favorite weekender bag. I could never carry this, um, you know, long term because I just, I accumulate crap in my bags. But the strap on this one is a little bit shorter. Um, it only hits, hmm, this isn't something you could carry crossbody. You have to carry it on your shoulder because it hits like right at the waist. So the chain is very small. I'm not sure you guys can see it, but it is a cute little, like I guess length um, if you are into the full crossbody. But I love this bag because it, like I said, H&M, it's affordable and it doesn't tear up. Like this is made of really good material. It's a great little bag. So the next one that I'm going to post, this is, it's a little weird because this exact purse is not sold anymore, but I can't remember the brand. Let me just, mm. Okay, so you can get a similar purse like this um, at Nordstrom Rack for about $25 to $30. Um, this bag I did purchase in Europe, but I have found so many dupes for it. It's like insane. Um, same exact brand, don't you worry. I'm going to link it below for you guys, but I love this bag because it's got a super duper long strap and every single time I carry this purse, I get a bajillion compliments on it because it's extremely deceiving. It fits so much stuff down in there. It has this amazing, huge deep pocket right here. And then it just carries so much stuff. So like for a um, crossbody, you could fit the whole kitchen sink in here. The whole family, the whole family can chill in this very affordable, cute and durable bag. And I don't know if you guys, if I even, We'll see how I edit this video. Okay, let's just be real. We'll see how I edit this video. And then that way you can carry it just as a clutch if you don't want to have the chain, which I don't always like the chain. It's actually is a really cute clutch, but like I said, I will be linking the similar one below to you guys. I know I'm so sorry. I hate to show you guys a bag that you fall in love with and I can't get to identical one, but they don't sell this bag anymore. So I'm going to link the most similar ones below and you can find them and they are affordable, which is the best. Okay, the best. And then this is the last handbag. Now, like I said, 170 is the original price of this. And for some people, that's not a lot, especially for Michael Kors. This bag, just like the other bags, is deceiving. This bag can fit, oh, it's so dirty. You look messy. But yeah, the bottom of the has been worn up a little bit, but it has the little um, strap inside for keys. It has a um, deep pocket that has the MK on it. All the lining says MK. But this bag, y'all, it fits like, it's gonna fit my car. But this bag is so cute and it's like a little salmon-y blush color and I get so many compliments on it. It is the perfect, if you're looking for an affordable designer bag, this is perfect for that. It is blush, has the Michael Kors on it. And it does sit closed like this you can see I love this bag though I got it on sale um, it was like $90 when I bought it but it's just a gorgeous bag it's all leather well made you can see the bottom is still really nice carried this bag for years and they still sell it on my course because I think it's like a classic this is almost like a staple which I will be doing a staple accessories video later this week don't you worry but this is definitely a staple piece it is affordable if you're looking for a designer and I love it because you can fit so much in here, although it does not look like it. All right guys, and that's pretty much it. This was a quick video. I just wanted to share with you my five favorite affordable handbags, like I have said over and over, just super quick. I love sharing handbags, I love sharing style tips and fashion stuff with you guys because this is a lifestyle channel. 
Make sure to go below and subscribe if you are not already. Give this video a big thumbs up if you love handbags just like I do. And I will see you in my next video.